Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video and today we got power on stalls. This is going to be one of the light items for the check ride and you're most likely going to do the power off stall as well. We'll do that one in another topic, but today the power on stall. To start it off, we're going to go through our acronym CPR HAA. C is going to be our clearing turns. Make sure no aircraft are in the area and end up on your visual reference point. Now we begin the P the pre-maneuver checklist. And to do this, we're gonna go with the reverse seven. So bringing our hand all the way down to the bottom, feel selector on, trim, set for maneuver, flaps up, cow flaps open, primers locked in, and for now, carburetor heat is gonna be on. And mixture is rich. Props and throttles leave where it needs to be, going through all your lights and making sure your fuel pumps and landing light are on. Now for the R, which is our radio calls showing our location and moving on to HAA heading altitude airspeed where we only have to worry about plus minus five on our heading for this maneuver all right now that we're set here we can begin the maneuver so getting ourselves out of the cruise configuration we're bringing the throttles back to 15 manifold pressure and our props are going forward pushing the props forward like this is going to change the actual blade angle on the propeller helping us slow down now, on our next steps, while maintaining the altitude, we're needing to slow to 80 knots indicated. So once we hit that airspeed, we're going to be pretty much beginning the maneuver right there. Set your power to 22 manifold pressure, carb heat is off. Increase the pitch to reduce the airspeed, recognize and announce the cues of impending stall, and recover at first indication. Saying this early will get us prepared and ahead of the aircraft, and just like that, carburetor heats are coming off once we reach our airspeed, full power and pitching up. As the altitude increases as well as our pitch, we're listening for that stall warning horn. Right as soon as we hear that, we're going to simply push or let go of our backwards pressure on the yoke. So we're going to be recovering at that first indication of the stall and leveling off at that altitude. So reducing that angle of attack, accelerating to our VX, announce and establish a positive rate of climb. Now we're going to accelerate and announce our VY and maintain that positive rate of climb as we level off at a sufficient altitude and call for and perform the cruise checklist. That's going to get ourselves back into that cruise configuration. So throttles are going to be coming back to the 2-0 and our props are going to be coming back as well, getting ourselves back to that 2-3 right about on our RPM gauge. Now that we've set settled ourselves here, we've pretty much gotten that maneuver set up for success. From here, you just go over your checklist and clean up, make sure those fuel pumps come off, lights are off, and you have recovered from the maneuver. But on our next episode, please let me know what you want to see in the next video. I'd love to help you guys out, and if you need any help, just leave a comment below so I can cover the next topic and get you set up for an even greater check ride. So, without further ado, I'll catch you guys later. Cheers!